Welcome to this first look at Medieval Kingdom Wars. This is a new game that was released in June 2017, Fortune in the Future. It's very much pre-alpha, early access, and it's produced by a company called Reverie World Studios. But I thought I'd have a look at it. I did buy it out of curiosity. I haven't played very much of it, but what I've seen so far, the graphics look good. Is And what I'm going to do is do the tutorial. As far as I know at the moment, now please bear in mind that this game is having regular releases. You can see the last one was on the 23rd of June. So things are changing all the time. But as far as I know at the moment, the campaign is not implemented. But what we're going to do is the tutorial. In the year of our Lord 1336, a peaceful and prosperous Europe is about to be plunged into war. With the blessing of Pope Benedict XII, the great powers of England and France have sworn to join together in a crusade to the Holy Land. They have amassed armies, weapons, and warships, but now they stand with their knives poised at each other's throats. In violation of recent treaties, England has laid claim to vast tracts of land in France, owned long ago by their ruling family, the Plantagenets. King Edward III, who took power in 1330, conspires to make Anjou, Aquitaine, Brittany, Normandy, and Poitou vassals of England again, despite the French people and culture that have flourished there for so long. Meanwhile, a new dynasty has taken power in France, the House of Valois, and they will no longer tolerate English ambitions on the continent. Secretly absolved of his crusader's vow by the Pope in 1336, King Philip VI of France, first of the Valois, has ordered the fleet he built for the crusade to move from Marseille into the English Channel. Philip's claim to the French crown is weak. He acceded only after three cousins died, each ruling barely more than two years. Standing up to England, will be his first real test. And he has begun by sending privateers to raid and harry the English coast. One of them, attempting to apprehend a French traitor in Dover, has gotten bogged down in a siege. Many ships in Philip's main fleet are commanded by minor nobles eager to please the king, and some of them went ashore to join in the impromptu siege. Their plan is to capture the traitor Robert of Artois and drag him back to Paris. Though the attack is not sanctioned by the French crown, surely the walls of Dover could be breached in the name of justice. Right guys, I let that intro run because that gave a nice view of the Grand Campaign map and uh, that is fantastic, I really like that map. Now these are a bit verbose so I'm going to kind of just rattle through them, you can pause the video if you want to watch them. As far as I can tell the response doesn't mean anything in this tutorial, maybe in the future. So I think we're just going to... I came for the fighting and looting. Pray tell me how I am new to this, okay. You can see here, you can move using WASD. And the center mouse button allows for a rotation. And you can see here we've got areas here that are being built up. I think we're over our siege camp here. You can zoom in and out with the scroll mouse. The only thing I do think is... I'd, I would prefer to zoom out a bit further because it can be a bit difficult to actually see what you're actually doing. You can't really get an overview of the map. Um, the pressing and holding the center mouse button allows you to rotate. I see many of our hot-headed troops tell me that I can use, I can use come on. Yeah, as I say, certain allows for rotation. 
top left button, use the left mouse button to select units, okay. So I think these are our units, these are Voltaires, and we got some Bowmen. And select mode to click anywhere with the left mouse button and draw a square so we can My see. lord needs Vougiers. That's interesting. Vougiers await your orders. Stand ready, men. So aren't these our troops? My lord needs Vougiers. Oh well. well. It says draw a box Vougiers and select all. Okay, it's orders. actually done it that time. I think there's a little bit of uh, inconsistency there. But we've got to capture the Palisade Keep. This is where I was saying is that not being able to zoom out means this. So we've got to break with Ram and charge up there. Okay. I think Bowman what we could probably ready. do is archers are doing it. bring the archers forward. Bowman, stand ready. Bowman, stand ready. We'll I don't know what this is. What's this? A Mat Matalette. Follow. Follow friendly unit. Must that matter? Was tasked to that task. Yeah. We await our orders. Okay. Lock your arrows, men. I think. Okay. Lord, we move. Get off. Lock your arrows, men. Ready to help me, Lord. That move? Stand behind us. Okay. Release your arrows, lads. It says break with a battering ram. Where's the battering ram? Ah. Ram standing by. Battering ram, there, guys. Good oak and mat, let's hear. Haul them over there, boys. These guys need some little bit of protection. Bowman, stand ready. Ready to help me, Lord. Okay, what? Where are you guys moving? I think it's a bit. It can be a bit chunky by the look of it. So, I think we've got plenty of fire. Guys. Say the zoom in's good. I like the zoom in guys, but well, got a feeling the arrow archers are a little bit overpowered. But then I must admit I do like my archers. Uh, what have we got here? Stand ready, men. Oh, bring these Move guys up. Well, oh, these are all dead. Bowman looks like the Bowman might actually win this for us. Capture the Palisade Keep. <laughs> I think the arrows are stuck in midair there, guys. Never mind. Okay. Where's my. Bougiers. My lord needs Bougiers. Bougiers. Pipes, do as you are ordered. Bougiers await your orders. up you go, guys. Bougiers will obey. Up here, and take. This is quite a simple battle. We've got allied forces kind of stood in the middle of our area here. What's that? Archery range. We've got an archery range in the middle. Okay. Sorry, I'm getting distracted, guys. Okay. And to capture the keep, what you're going to do is just they just stand here, get shot to pieces. And that gives us the. And they should be able to just stand there and capture this. I think the archers Lock your arrows, we men. can pull back, I think. There we are. We've captured the palisade.
Uh, the enemy doth regroup along their battlements, marry the, by the mass, they call us for negotiations. Not for negotiations, stubborn dogs, let us dig in, okay. Or wouldn't you not get bogged down? Draw this some way to hurry along. I think that flash was the weather effects, because there is weather effects in this game. Okay. And I think what we need to do My is Lord pull, needs pull these guys here. back. I was just going to get shot to buggery. That first we need resources. Select your serfs and then order them to chop down wood and loot the fallen. My Lord, what okay. do you need? Swing those axes, fellas. What are you going to do? Plant gathering. Pass the livestock. How do you lo loot the fallen then? I don't know what that is. So it doesn't. What's that loot? This ain't right. My lord, what do you need? I think that's meant to loot the fall fallen, but the developer can build a barn and acquire additional livestock. Okay. We need to and to build things. You've got to click on here and just build a barn. Struck mine buildings to acquire stone and iron. Buildings are placed on building plots. Okay, I think that's a building plot. I think we can have build an iron camp there. And I think we need stone. Build a stone camp there. I think we'll just get these guys. We need we need loads of wood. Always probably need loads of wood. So swing those axes, fellas. So let's train additional serfs, okay. We'll do that. So it's objective construct a palisade, okay. And this is how you build palisades, guys. You, yeah, you just click it and it all starts to auto build itself like that. Now, the downside is that. You can't seem to be able to stop it. Once you've got it going, it seems to build and it just seems to consume all your resources. It's time to build some buildings and train some archers, construct various buildings. There you need siege works and an archery, okay. Now the question is, where am I gonna build stuff? Oh we can build something here. Okay, let's build a barracks here. Can't build anything there. Got that building there. The siege workshop. That's not my siege workshop. Hmm. I don't seem to have any more build slots. Horses here. Why is that? It's almost like my allies have built stuff. Ah, I can build. I think we can build uh, an archery range in there. Okay, we've got an archery range. Got that building there. We got. We, we certainly need plenty of wood. No, we don't have space for our soldiers to rest. We need more housing. Use the serfs to create additional armies. Okay. Place tents. Sh hold shift to place multiple buildings. For sure, my lord. Okay. Out some stone here. Out some that works. Doesn't actually show any footprints. I assume I've built for. Ready to siege. I think. Get that Don't out of the way. Me, team. Now I need another building slot. Breed additional animals. Okay. Let's train some a couple of cows and some pigs. The pigs slowly generate food resources. Pigs can be slaughtered for food. My peasants have fattened up are faster than any other livestock. Okay. Cows. Okay. These guys are chopping wood. What? My archery range. Seem to be able to find any more building slots. So 
this my palisade. Good oak and mantle, let's hear. What? I'm still sure, still, still not sure what that mantle is. is ready, my lord. I think it'd be useful if you could spot these building slots a bit better. I just don't seem, can't seem to find another building slot. A building is okay. finished, my lord. That's the barn. That's the manor. That's, that's a high thing there. I've got an arch. This is a archery range, but it's that area there. Right, that gives us archers. What we got here, Billman, Mason. I think we'll get a couple of Macemen, Voltaires. I think if we build swordsmen, that will preserve our wood. Thou uh, does not have sufficient resources. Why can't why, I need another slot to build? Because I've built. I haven't got anywhere to build a siege engine. This is crazy. Some of our workers are doing nothing. See, it's almost like my build slots have been stolen. Anything over here? Hmm. I think there might be a little bit of a bug or feature in this, guys. Because of course you can't build anywhere you want. You've actually got to. But oh, they actually actually built all these these buildings. Nothing there. And why? So we've built the palisade. Okay. I don't think we could build another an inner one, but all that's going to do is consume all my wood, and I can't see the point of that to be honest, guys. So, you know, because I think the palisade runs along these kind of spikes, or I can't remember what they're called now. Uh, the archers put them out. My lord needs vougiers. Vougiers. What have we got here? Awaiting your orders. Okay. Get to it. The, the other thing. I think what what they really need, guys, we should be able to click here and set a rally point. I think that that would be useful as well, guys. Because okay, the moment we don't have a rally point, our blaze will serve the realm. Okay, it's an archery range. Where's my other archery range? There it is. Here. Okay, we need we've got the troops and crossbowmen, eighty wood. Archers, longbowmen. I think got some. I think maybe we'll get. Thou must gather more resources oh. first. Okay, let's get. Resources. Our blades will serve the realm. Oh, we don't have enough food. Okay. Let me wash my hands first. Uh, you're meant to be Get chopping wood. Actually, maybe can we? 122. Maybe if we get some more serfs to gather the food up. Our blaze will serve okay. the realm. Got loads and loads of Cross troops. Crossbows with steady arms, my lord. This has been bombed as well. Great. Upgrade building level, train crossbows, pair building. Born to work, my lord. So I can't build a siege engine. There's nothing over here, is there? A bit crazy, guys. I got loads of troops, but I can't build a siege. Engine or body. Crossbows with steady arms, my lord. It'd also be used if this, this actually, because I assume this is food, this is wood. I don't know if that's iron or that's stone. I'd say that's iron and that's stone. We got loads of iron. Why am I? Okay, let's demolish that. And let's build a Actually, 
that build a siege workshop here. Okay. Plenty of cash. Archery range. I think a little bit of wood. 50, 80. Okay, where's uh let me push me hands first. Task workers. Workers will slaughter and gather food from livestock animals, okay. From the Lord's table. You do that guys. Crossbows, get ready. Winding up, taking action. Right. Get these troops over here. Because they seem to want to bombard this area here. Crossbows to it. We've got all our troops recruited. What we need now is trebuchets. Strong mule bent to your service. Siege workshop. Okay. Requires siege workshop master. So I can't build it. Okay. Uh, upgrade. No. Search. Search master siege works. What have we got? Search siege torches. Okay. Let's build that, guys. I think we're doing okay. We've got a bit of food now. We've got troops. We got a few too many troops actually. Crossbows, get ready. I think I might just keen eyes, gleaming gears. So I've just killed those guys, but they were damaged. We might might what we'll do is recruit them new. Okay, research eighty percent. Spawning, that's it, spawning. Okay. It still won't. Do I have to upgrade it? Okay, let's upgrade it. This requires Siege Workshop Master Siege Works. Unit will cost six percent less. Doesn't make sense. Okay, let's demolish it then. This is, there's something not right here, guys. Um, what we got here? Build archery range. Build church. Build siege workshop. Okay. Longbows, be alert. Eagerly now, lads. Looks like these guys are getting killed just by standing around. I think what we, we could do and is obey. move. Now we're going to have to attack up through here, so let's just Put your backs into it. get this thing out, on, out the way. Uh, sorry, this is going to be a bit of a drag, guys. Things are a bit weird at the moment. I can't understand why. It did work. I, um, I did do. I played as far as here. I've played the first part of this tutorial before, and it actually worked. So where are you going? I thought I put you up here. Ready to siege. Yeah, the, the Come on, men. Uh then again, as I said, this game is early access, so Okay. Now I can build it. I think there's a bit of a bug here, guys. Because that is the same building. 
It's almost like the research is not taking an effect. Just whack out the uh, trebuchets. That will just look a trebuchet. Ain't okay. she awesome? Uh, again, I think we're we'll get you over here. Get it moving, men. What do we got? How many we got to build? Six. Okay. Do not have enough wood. Hey, keep the guys chopping wood. Look, a trebuchet. Ain't she awesome? Okay, it's not picking up. Trebuchet crew, alert. Trebuchet crew, alert. Let's. Start the bombardment, I suppose. So I'm Learning leaving this trebuchet. trebuchet. Get it moving, men. I think what we probably could do is bombard here a bit as well, I think. We hear and obey. Look lively, team. Can you get up the wall? Put your backs into it. Okay. One mighty machine here. Ah, there we are. What can we do here? Hold fire, attack ground. You can say hello to these troops. a trebuchet over here somewhere. Wow, here we go. In. See damage. Okay. You require additional housing, my lord. Let's find villagers. Okay, we need more housing. Carving out some stone here. My lord needs bougiers. Uh, bougiers. <laughs> For that, really suck more. Guys, Trebuchet crew, alert! A Trebuchet crew dead? Okay. Trebuchet. Loading trebuchet. Trebuchet. My lord, some of my workers need to be given jobs. Hit him high and hard. Let me wash okay. my hands first. Loads of food. Chop wood. Chop chopping wood. on those trees. <laughs> we have nowhere to house these new fellows. Got enough for left resources. Okay, so so we still can't shift. Carving out some stone here. Carving out some stone here. Build some houses, please. Come on. My workers have completed a build. Look, a trebuchet. Ain't she awesome? Okay. One mighty machine here. Get it moving, men! Get another trebuchet over here. Just get them pounding. 
the ground, guys. A new structure is ready, my lord. Hey. You cannot afford that, sire. Uh, I got no wood. Okay. One mighty machine here. Okay. Trebuchet crew, alert! Get it moving, men. Thy workers. Loading trebuchet. Are you having fun over here, guys? I think I think you can. I presume uh, there's no indication of range on this. I presume they've got the range, seeing that they're able to bombard my encampment. Right. Honored for sure, my lord. Chop wood. And there's no slow there though. Okay, guys, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to let things run forward a little bit. Trebuchet crew, alert! This is the first time we got, guys. So I've got no idea what's going on. I don't know. Let's ha not tarry no longer, my lord. Don't as the trebuchets to hand us, they'll commence a bombardment of the gatehouse. Please think in mind the trebuchet hold large amounts of stone. Their stockpiles will be exhausted rapidly. Okay. Oh, there's a little blood, a little bloodshed as possible. Wow. It's a... One mighty machine here. Okay. Triple shade. Great. One mighty machine here. On mod with triple shade. Okay. Hold distance. Hold them to protect. Hold them to protect them. Okay. One mighty machine. Gate house will breach to take a minute or two. Ah, so probably the tutorial wouldn't let me actually. One okay. mighty machine here. I didn't think I'd oh. built six. I got one, two, three, four. Trebuchet crew, alert! Okay. You guys can smash your way through. One, two, three, four, five. As far as I can see, I've got five trebuchets, not six. Oh, did I build one and it's been destroyed? Okay. Some of thy workers are doing nothing, my lord. Yeah. I don't know why I keep saying that. Okay. I think what we can do now. Bowman, stand ready. Is we'll start moving our troops forward. It. Oh, why didn't I pick them all Bougiers up? Okay. Your orders. Move as commanded, men. Crossbows, get ready. Crossbows. Winding up, taking action. It's almost like you select by unit. The first one that my lord needs Bougiers. The first unit you pick up is actually the one that's. Very accurate. Loading trebuchet. Hey. Hey guys. Yes, we got them. Okay. Again, I, I wish you could zoom out further. I suppose because I fight Total War, I'm used to fighting at a higher level than this. Okay. We await our orders. Archers forward. We move. Look alert, boys. We got here swordsman, swordsman, bowman, maceman. Are you would be yours? Actually, guys, let's bum rush it. Awaiting your orders. Because that's what we've got to go Sit after. Them, boys. Uh, trebuchets. I don't want any friendly fire. No I don't know if there's trebuchet. any friendly fire in this game, but I think what we can do is just say hello to these guys. And the troops are rushing across. Lock. Guerrero's men. Oh, 
uh, hacking our way through, guys. Obviously, there's some surfs here, and the arrows are flying left, right, and center. Bombard with trebuchets. Is that it? Yep, it looks like we've won, guys. I do like the battle maps, I must admit, even, and I think I'd appreciate them more if I could zoom out further. Trust me, compliments can be heard all throughout the camp. None of us wanted this, but here we are. We must sort out matters as best we can. Trees must be cut down, but timber and mines must be needed. Perhaps we should loot corpses and slaughter livestock as well and finish the palisade walls, construct the buildings. But they haven't surrendered yet. <laughs> God's death, the British lawyers of Ajorn have been so indiscriminate, mark my words. A full-scale war of England may very well follow. An army is sent by... Our good King Philip to restore order in Ajon that is now trapped by the English in the Siege of Orleans. Wretched news indeed, for I know your family is from Orleans, and my estate is just on the other side of Loire. I swear that these vile dogs will burn my crops. Okay. Oh, to all okay, we're just gonna go to Orleans. I presume this is the next part of the tutorial, guys. I'm aware that I don't know. We'll have a quick look at this next step. If it starts to get too long, guys, I'll split it, because this is very much a first overview. I must admit, I do like this game. I think it's got a lot it of potential. Ironic, it's obviously got a long way to go. Once swore fealty to France for the land England still holds on the continent. <laughs> that was in 1327, when he was only 15. At the time, England needed peace to fight Scotland in the north. But a truce with Scotland's King David II has been announced, and King Edward, now a grown man, is ready to make his move on the continent. Edward's first ploy is inciting loyalists in Anjou to rise up against the French, sending word far and wide that landless sons and military opportunists are welcome to join in and claim new estates for themselves. He wants to destroy Philip's army in Orléans, before it takes the field. But his long-term strategy will be to seize the crown of France itself. No need to manage Orleans awaits. Okay. I think I've got a lost bit of a lost cursor here, guys. I can't seem to be able to Okay, guys. Oh no, I've got control of the cursor again. Uh, can we? Yeah, we can get back this way. Okay, guys. I think this. I will just have a quick look at the campaign map. I, I do like this campaign map. I think it's the artwork is very, very good, and it translates. It's going to make a very interesting campaign. And as I say, I think this is where I'm going to leave it. First impressions, I like this game. I think it's got a lot of potential. Obviously, it's got a long way to go. It's still got a few features. The drift with the cursor is a little bit of an issue. But you can see the size of the campaign map. You can get all the way down to Italy. Uh, we're over in Austria, Scotland. And we're going to get all the way down to Portugal. Down, right down here, maybe... Uh, we can't get quite into Africa, so it's going to be a quite a nice big campaign map to play on as well. As I say, this game is, bear in mind guys, that yes there are a few problems because it is early access, but I will be tracking this game in the future. Obviously there's a bit more left on the tutorial, and what I would do, because I don't seem to, seem to be an option to save, turn game, okay, main menu. Ah, I think I might have just messed that up, guys. Anyway, don't seem to have a save game option at the moment. Ah, that could, yes, that's just brought me back to here. I don't know what it would do. Resume your campaign or tutorial prologue, save game. Okay, Let's see what that does. Yeah, so I will be following this in the future. And uh, what I will do is, if, I think I've messed the tutorial up here, guys. But I think what I will do is, I will 
work through. It is ironic that King Edward yes, III of England once swore. Yeah, it's. No, no need. I will manage all in. Ah, so it's actually taken me. So I've got a save game, which brings me back to here. Okay, I think that's a good place to stop them. I think if any devs happen to wander on here, I think some kind of formal save might be useful, guys. Uh, maybe, alright, it's this the tutorial. Hopefully in the normal campaign, having the ability to save will, will be very, very useful. But this is where I'm going to leave it, guys. Hope you enjoyed this kind of brief first look. I am impressed. I do like it. I will be tracking this game in the future. And... Maybe once I get a gist of the skirmish mode, I mean, so if we flip back to main menu, just to show you guys, hopefully that I won't lose the save game, but just to give you a quick view of the modes. Okay, because what you've got, I won't go into campaign, you've also got skirmish mode here. And you can see here that it's actually multiplayer orientated. As I and you can actually see who's online. Um, there and flip back and there's obviously a ranking and there's obviously there's plans to have some form of association. Now at the moment you can only play France. And if and if you click new game. You've got the option of playing with your friends or yourself. I don't know how that actually works. I don't know if that's fully implemented. It says friends only here. And then you can actually decide on what type of victory. So obviously this is going to be like a custom battle skirmish on here. And you can obviously play. I presume that you can just configure it to the way you want it. So you can actually decide on what there is. And at the moment there's obviously only a few options Dover, Orleans and Paris so obviously there's a long way to go and you name the battle but that's something I will look at once I've finished the tutorial so there definitely will be a part on that in the future guys but this is where I'm going to leave it hope you enjoyed this first look as I said I will revisit this in the future and I certainly will be tracking the game because this game has a lot of potential and I think it's going to be a good game in the future guys so right this is where I'm going to leave it guys hope you enjoyed this video and until next time whatever you do enjoy your gaming